Good morning, party people. It's 10 a.m. And when I tell you, honey, I've been sleeping. I've been waking up and going back to sleep since 4 o'clock this morning. Sitting on the edge of the bed, saying I'm about to get up and go finish shopping um, since about 8, 7.38. But finally, I'm out. And I'm about to have a hair appointment at 3. I wasn't going to get my hair done, but I'm looking very crusty. I'm just going to get the lady who braided my daughter's hair, who like did the cornrows last time that I found at Walmart, to do like some single some mini braids in my hair. That's what she's going to do. And I'm going to wear those mini braids. Probably, I'm just going to leave with them. Either I'm going to get them redone, or I'm just going to leave with those same mini braids, because I don't want to be doing no hair. I don't want to be doing nothing. Um, I believe that I am late to the party, um, as far as... Um, like I'm late to the party as far as going shopping. Like the stores are probably already packed, but I need to get my husband some, like I need to shop for my husband. And yesterday I was really like in a rush and I really want to make this Christmas special for him. Like he is making it special for me, has made it special for me, is making it special for me. I want to really um, get him, <clears throat> him some good stuff. So I'm about to go, I think to the, girl, what is on my face? I'm just looking crusty. I want to go, I want to go to the mall. Um, but we're going to see. I got seafood to eat when I come back. So I'm about to stop by Starbucks before we even, like, get started shopping or anything like that. Because I have. Um, they gave my husband a Starbucks gift card, and he doesn't want it. So I'm going to use the Starbucks card. And let's head out. Okay, let's head out. All right, so I'm here at Kohl's. I didn't even think about going to Kohl's, but we're going to see what Kohl's has. Because it's like... In like a department store without me having to go to the mall there's already a lot of people out here so there's that um i had a sugar cookie almond latte from starbucks that is gone it was decent and then my cheese danish um because i'm having seafood when i get home like i said so let's go in here and see if kohl's has some goodies and then there's a ross that's like on the same strip y'all know i can't drive so I'm gonna have to like, I'm staying very close to home. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So I'm gonna go to this Ross right here. There's also a famous footwear. I wanted to get my son like some, uh, you know, some shoes, some nice shoes, if I can find some. And then, cause I, he's, I'm done shopping for him, but if I can just get him one more thing and then I need to get some stuff for my husband. So let's see what I find in here. So I'm back from Kohl's. Um, they had like a lot of stuff in there. However, the, the store is very, it's priced like it's priced, okay? And I'm one of the people, I'm not used to paying, well, I'm not used to paying, no, for real. I'm not used to paying like, I'm not really gonna pay above $20 for much of anything. That's like, especially stuff that you wear just because you like stuff and you don't like stuff so frequently, at least I do. Um, however, um, I was shopping for men's things and they tend to be even more expensive. Um, so, yeah, I spent $171. And then they gave me $30 in Kohl's cash. I really didn't spend that much. Yeah, $30 in Kohl's cash. So I didn't spend that much. I'm going to make sure that I go back and spend this. I'm probably going to get, like, some workout tights or something. Um, so we're going to head next door. I did find, like, a lot of apparel things. I still want to get him a really nice cologne and I think I'm going to get him some shoes. I was going to pick up those vans for my son. But I'm like, nah, this is my husband's shopping. Like, I'm going to shop for my husband. I do want to get my son some shoes. But I want to get, like, I want to make sure, like I said, that my husband is having, like, a really good Christmas, too. Because 
he always makes sure that everybody else has stuff and I want his Christmas to be special. So I'm looking for that one item that's like, every year I find one that's like, ooh. So I want to find that. Okay, so that was very eventful. I have never been to this Ross before, and when I tell you it was jumping, jumping, as you can see, they had so much stuff. And I don't know if it's usually like that or if it's just like that for the holidays, but they had so much stuff and so much people. So I got everything that I'm going to get as of right now. There's still Michaels, and I really still want to check out Famous Footwear, so I think I'm just about to run in there right quick. It's 12.29, so I have, what, three hours before my hair appointment, and I'm done. I'm done shopping. Um, yeah, I really so let me show you guys my nails because don't look at my hands. Do you see that? You see my thumb? How, like, let's see, you see how crusty it is? Like, the skin is dry and peeling. This is from basic training. My hands did not look like this before I left. Um, but this hand, this nail right here actually hurts. Like, you see that? My hands didn't look like this, but this is how they look now. So I'm contemplating on whether I want to go like to get my nails done. It's really not get my nails done, like actually like like get a manicure. But I know that usually they do nails like for aesthetics, at least the place that I've been to and they don't really like do nails for like treatment. You know what I mean? I think that this is a culmination of things because we we're doing push-ups. I mean, we're in a dirt. I wash my hands a lot, a lot of hand sanitizer, and just a lot of doing stuff with your hands in general that we weren't used to doing, like ropes and stuff like that. And I think that's why my hands like this. And also, we had to stand outside in the cold a lot um, for hours, um, so much so that your hands, like hands and feet, you know, like if you stand outside in the cold, your the, your outer extremities like this are not really important to your body, so the blood circulation isn't very good once you're like freezing so it's literally standing there with your toes and your fingers just feeling like they're frozen i think it's poor circulation getting to my fingers for that reason also that has them like really looking terrible and they feel really weird too they feel like and i wasn't i everybody that i was around reported the same thing um that their fingers feel like it's just poor circulation. I don't know how else to explain it. But now that I'm like in a normal climate and like doing normal things, my hands actually hurt. So I want to just, I, like I said, I kind of want to go get them done. And then I also kind of want to order something because I'm going to have to do this again once I come back, like after basic training and all that kind of stuff. So let's see. Let me, let me do a few calculations and see if I'm like on target, on budget. I'm going to go into Michael's and then I'm going to go into Famous Footwear. So I'm gonna show y'all my hair fully when I get home. Well, you can kind of see it in here. It's real cute. She braided them, literally all of my braids are this small. And then she kind of like did my hair in a style, kind of like people who have dreads. Like when you get dreads, they like style the dreads. So she hooked your, sister, she hooked your girl up. Um, as you can see, I went in to pick up a few more things. Like um, I went to pick up like some hoodies and stuff for my husband. They have like track suits in Walmart, like the one I got. This one that I got on, it came from Walmart, like the little, cartoony ones like that so i picked him up one and some other stuff i'll show you guys that stuff when i get home i'm about to go to joanne fabrics the craft store and then i'm done like i'm not buying anything else i'm probably not going to leave the house anymore that's it okay so i'm about to head to joanne and i'm gonna see y'all later all right so obviously i'm back at home here's my hair up close so you can see it it's really cute like i said she braided it like she did another style within the style i just finished eating my seafood I'm enjoying this little vegan muffin and some eggnog mixed with, let me show you what this stuff is. It's like apple something. Crisp apple? Oh, apple pie. Bailey's apple pie. So, oh wait, Alexa, stop. 
got the holiday lo-fi going. I so miss my lo-fi music. And now I'm about to sit in here and wrap these gifts. So I'm gonna set up like a little station over here. My husband's in the back because this stuff is his stuff. So let me set up all this stuff out here and then I might chat with y'all while I wrap it. Sounds good? Sounds good. Right, so it's really not all that organized. I just kind of put everything over here. And I'm gonna try to put as much stuff as I can in the bag. And yeah, so these are the little things that I got for my daughter. I'm about to put in her stocking real quick. I think all the other stocking stuffs are stuffed. Well, they literally keep coming in here, so I gotta hurry up. Cause she is gonna come in here. All right, so the quality, the lighting isn't all that good, but let's just go through a few of these things so I can go do what I'm doing, okay? Um, so I got these. These are actually for you guys. At some point, I'm gonna do another giveaway. I'm not waiting for any specific number, just I guess when I get some things that I wanna give away. So these little, um, what do you call it? Reflexology foot mats. I got two of them. One of them I'm gonna keep for myself, and then the other one, gonna be for one of you guys <coughs> and i also got this let's cover up the price i found this little thing that was at a really really good price at ross and i'm like if you gonna you know if i can help out i can help out so i decided to put this in there that's gonna be in a little pile of things i don't know if you guys remember that little neck pillow that i have that the blue one um like the cervical aligner um, I have one of those coming, and that's also going to go in the pile of, like, stuff to give away. And, moving on, there's some stuff that I got for me. So, I was doing Christmas shopping, but I was also doing me shopping because I haven't went shopping in a long time. Look at this. I showed you guys they had, like, a bunch of um, gel pins. I think the highest amount I saw was 180 gel pins. Um, I made up my mind that I'm going to start scrapbooking especially like a journey like the one that I'm on right now. It definitely has a lot of moments, pictures, and just things that could be documented. So I'm definitely gonna document it. I'm gonna start scrapbooking and I decided to buy these. Um, shirts, I got these from Five Below. Five Below always has a nice shirt selection. Something real cute, just a little throw on something. Shirts, they're all $5 of course. Kitty, you're supposed to be laying down. And it's a little, I think it's sushi. So there's that. I found this at Kohl's and I have been wanting one of these for a while. This worked really good if you want to like deep condition your hair, especially if you have, if you have low porosity hair and yeah, y'all know how it goes. If you're a low porosity girl, you know exactly what I'm talking about. 
Here it is. It's a heating cap. 30 minutes, up to 30 minutes of portable heat. So you can like, I actually thought it was something that you plug in. You microwave it. Wow. Yeah, so you microwave it and you just put it on. Heating cap. Probably works really good for like headaches and stuff too. And then I got some storage containers. This came from Ross. It was a really good price. I think, look. $4.99, girl. You know, you know I need storage, okay? Um, also got these black um, sweatpants from Ross. Nothing special. A little sketchbook. Which I'm probably actually going to use this as my scrapbooking book. Because I was going to buy a book that was specific to scrapbooking. But they would be way too overpriced for no good reason. So I think I'm going to use this one. Now that I think about it. Um, I got myself a planner for this next year and then i got one of you guys a planner so obviously this stuff is going to go out pretty soon because i want you to get the planner you know in a decent time frame um and i bought this just like a writing notebook i'm probably going like a journal probably going to bring this with me back to basic training actually and i got this for myself just because i'm corny like that <laughs> And I like to play with slime too. Um, 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 this came from Walmart. Strawberry champagne body salt. Because I'm definitely going to take as many baths as I can while I'm home. I found this at Walmart and I couldn't leave it there because if you know, you know. Back in the day, the problem of girls was the ish. And it's just like an oversized powder puff girl shirt. And... This is on sale at Michael's for $4.99, scrapbooking paper, so I just got some of it. I have a bunch of this, like, kind of paper, but I do not have this design, so I picked this up. And some washi tape. So, that's it for this whole thing today. I don't know what else I'm going to put on this video. I don't know if it's going to be the end of this video. I'm trying to do you guys a little vlog a day while I'm home. However, I'm also trying, even more than I am put out vlogs, is to really enjoy this time at home. Because I'm telling you, when it's all said and done, when I get back, I have so much to tell you guys that I can hardly even stomach sitting in front of you without mentioning it. Okay? I can hardly stomach it. I've been reading you guys' comments and stuff today, and I'm so excited to see that you're equally as excited for me to be back and miss me just as much as I miss y'all. Because when I tell you, like... You never really know like that you have community, that you build community until you don't have that anymore. I'm really grateful and blessed to have, um, you know, a great group of men and women who are supportive of me and that I really do want to hear about what's going on in your life too. So that's exciting to, like I said, to have been reading you guys' comments all day. Even though that video that I did see you guys yesterday, it was supposed to be up last night. However, when I woke up this morning, it had not finished loading. So... I'm, like I said, I have a goal, I have a plan to get to do a little vlogmas with you guys. However, I have to keep in mind that I only got 17 days here and I need to enjoy those to the fullest. And making videos right now might not be at the highest priority, you know what I mean? Spending time with my family and things like that is. So, as always, if you have a question, ask a question and... I'll see you guys probably once I get my Christmas stuff. I'll put it on this video. We're going to double this video up, all right? I'll see you guys later. That's it. What, her crying? Mm-hmm. It's a new dawn, a new day! It's the next day. It's the next day. It's 10.58 in the morning. And let me tell you, I'm living my best life, okay? That's all I have to say is I'm living my best life. And in living my best life. So, my efforts to continue to eat three meals a day have failed. Um, I haven't eaten anything at all today. I did drink some eggnog. <laughs> that I did do. I drink eggnog for, I guess, my morning, I guess, breakfast, huh? Had a cup of eggnog. Um, I'm about to go back to this place. Remember I told you guys about Dave's Hot Chicken? Uh, because my husband hasn't tried it. It's a new place here. My husband hasn't tried it. So I'm going to go pick up some, some Dave's Hot Chicken. And then I'm also going to pick the kids up some pizza. And my daughter bit through her pacifier last night. And I don't have time for that. <laughs> I know she's four and all. But 
homie still sucks a pacifier, so we still gonna give her the pacifier, okay? I know what the dentist said. I know it's gonna cost some money to get her teeth in order. Um, however, I don't care. So, I need to get her pacifier, and when I go do that, I might go to the craft store. So I placed the order on Amazon for like some, so I opened my Christmas stuff today. I'm gonna show you guys it probably tonight, the gifts that I got. I am totally elated about them. Um, but I didn't go overboard because I really have everything that I kind of like want. But I did get a diamond dots thing. I wanted it like I asked for it. I don't know if you know, but it's kind of like a little rhinestone. It's like building picture. It's kind of like a puzzle, but it's a puzzle with rhinestones. Like they're like color by number type of thing. So y'all know me. If I'm going to get something, I got to get all the accoutrements that go with it. So I have some stuff coming in from Amazon for that and I might go to the craft store today just depends on how I feel when I get to the other side because though we had Christmas this morning like we opened Christmas gifts it's still very much Christmas like traffic and stuff like that y'all know what I'm not supposed to be doing I cannot drive so I'm not driving all right all right um I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get back home okay well maybe when I get the hot chicken one or two but it's 11 o'clock they open right now so let me go get this food All right, so we have, let, let's try to get a true depiction of what this desk is looking like right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Junk, 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 junk. Over here on the floor, a bunch of junk. So what I'm going to try to do right now is sort it out. And while I'm sorting it out, I just want to kind of go through it with you guys. Um, we opened Christmas presents this morning, so I'm gonna show you a little bit of what I got. I'm not gonna go through everything because this really ain't about that, but I realize that it is the holiday time and you guys might be interested. So first I'm gonna start off with electronics. So let's move this here. So I'm not really an electronic girl. My husband loves electronics. He's one of those people who knows the new things that are out and I just kind of get the benefits of having some of the newer things or just some of the technology in general when I really don't need them. Not when I really don't need them. When I really don't care to have them, you know what I mean? But they are nice once you do have them. So y'all know for basic training, I had this little watch that I got. I think it was like 30 something dollars from Walmart. It doesn't do anything. I want to keep this watch on because I still have to go back to basic training. And yeah, this is all you can have. However, um, y'all know I gave my Apple watch away to my little sister before I left. I gave my headphones away. So I gave all of my like Apple electronics away to my little sister. My husband, baby, bought me the brand new watch. I don't know what the new watch is. I just know that here it is right here, okay? Now y'all know I like to run and stuff like that. And I've, ne I've always been a fan of Garmin for running because it's really a runner's watch. However, Garmin does not pair with the iPhone. Like in that you don't get notifications. No matter how high end, you can pay $500 for a Garmin watch and you still not gonna get that one notification. So for that reason, we decided to stick with Apple. And it's a little plum band because my phone case is purple. So kind of like keeping it all matchy matchy. It's real cute. I'm not gonna put it on until I come back, but. And to be honest with you, the Apple watch that I had before, I didn't know any of the specs of that watch. I kind of just put it on and wear it. So this is probably my favorite gift that I got. And like I said, I'm not really an electronic girl. Um, however, I didn't realize how much I would really, really like this. So he got me these Beats. Now I have, I've never owned Beats. Um, I have used Beats, but I've never, I've never had a brand new pair, uh, uh, girl. So the way that they packaged the headphones, I didn't like get myself open it, but the way that they packaged the headphones just felt like, you know, it felt like, you know, it felt a little, so here they are, go figure, he got me the camel ones because green is my favorite color, but the army ones, I guess is fitting as well. So these are just my running headphones. Y'all know I still like to use my AirPods for like, well, he gave me his AirPods because I gave my AirPods to my little sister, but I still like to use my AirPods for like everyday tasks, walking around the house, cleaning up, talking on the phone, stuff like that. So that's the electronics. Now let's move into the, some of the stuff. Y'all know the stuff that I like to play with, okay? Um, I think I showed you guys some of this stuff yesterday that I bought for myself. This is another little thing that he got for me, which this is cute. I've always wanted one of these little water bottles with like the little sayings and times and stuff like that. 
I, this is one of my goals where I'm home is to drink as much water as I was drinking before I left. So I'm excited about this. Um, what did I show you guys already? Oh, I didn't show you guys this, but this was in that, the stuff that I bought the other day. Just a little nail kit. It says Revline Barbie, whatever that means. I just know I need a nail kit because like I told you guys, my hands are like ate the heck up. Um, this little bowl, um, it's a food safe bowl to eat like my noodles. I'm probably gonna make some noodles tomorrow. This, I don't know. Don't judge me. Stay, get, get away with your judgment. That's just a bug. It's like a moth or something in here. Okay. So this is also something I just got from Joanne when I told you guys I went to Joanne. Um, scrapbook. Cute, 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 cute little picture. I was gonna just like use that book that I had, but I wanted a book that was actually for scrapbooking. So yeah, just to make it easier on myself, I wanted to like, you know, um, this because the Army Adventure is gonna be the first page in our scrapbooking. I got a diamond dots thing for Christmas and y'all know I had to go out and get some extra stuff. So this is just little diamond dots thing. Of course, I'm gonna do this on my uh, my TikTok and things like that. More things for the Diamond Dot. Scrapbooking paper. Um, this is literally just one sheet because I thought it was cute. And I canceled the other thing that I ordered from on Amazon just because I can do this one now. Like, I don't have to wait until Tuesday until it gets in. It's just the backlight so that you can um, so you can see where you're placing the little diamond. Um, I don't think I showed you guys this. I got this from Ross, right? It was only $3.99. So, like I said, I never have it. I can never have enough storage just because I have like all these beads and stuff like that. I believe I showed you guys the other one. So let me show you this. Cause I lied. The beats weren't even my favorite. The beats were my favorite electronic present that he got me. This was my favorite present that I've gotten in a very long time. A present that I didn't know that I wanted slash needed. Baby, look at this. This is a journal Bible. It's an NIV version of the Bible. It's spiral, honey. It's huge, it's beautiful. So once I clean off my desk, it's actually going to live here. And it's literally the Bible with blank pages on the side. Literally, you can you can pull it apart and read and learn. And I really, really love this. Like, I definitely wouldn't have spent, I wouldn't have bought this for myself. But it's definitely one of those gifts, like, I didn't know I needed it. I'm really excited about this one. So, let's put this to the side. Um, Here's a diamond dots thing that I got. So, I don't know. I'll, I'll put the picture of what it is on the screen. And then it comes with, it came with like some of the little dots and then some of the little things that you pour the rhinestones in and then like the little dotting tool, it came in a kit. But, they come in kits. You know, <laughs> kits are never enough. So I went, <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. I went to Joanne Fabrics and I got, you guys will see, you'll see this stuff later, but I got a bunch of these. They were seven for $10 and these are the little like diamond dot things. So it's basically like rhinestone painting. If you don't know what it is, it's, that's basically what it is. Making pictures with rhinestones. And yeah, they've kind of like, I guess, capitalize on just selling a picture that's already made so you don't have to think about what you're making and then they because this is just rhinestones so then they like you know made special little containers and things like that and so it's people who like me so let me open this amazon thing because one of the things that i ordered today from amazon came in today because amazon be coming through like that let's open it so here is this is the kit a little thing that holds those little these little rhinestones that I was telling you about. So I bought the little thing. So in case I want to do this, like, you know, I could take the whole, if I want to go do it at the park or something like that, I can like travel with the whole thing. So here's a little case. I'm going to open it and see what it looks like because I know what it looks like online, but I don't know what it really looks like. Oh my God. Look at that. So then 
all of these little things. These are the same size as this. So I can literally just take that and just pop it inside there. No, nope, you can't, because this is smaller. So this one's smaller, so I'm gonna have to pour them into those, which is fine. TikTok content. So there it is. And then it came with some extra little tools and things like that. And a funnel. Okay. Very interesting. I think it's 60. Like it can hold 60. I don't plan on buying any more of them, but you never know. Oh, and this. I ordered this. <clears throat> I ordered this hair moisturizer. The lady who did my hair the other day, she was saying like, like, well, obviously you guys know I have a lot of hair, but my hair, I have low porosity hair and my hair is very, 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 very dry. And I have been on the quest to leave my hair alone. Like leave the weaves alone and like put my hair in a style that I might think that is all that cute, but just leave it in a style and just let it be so that it can grow and that it can flourish. But it also needs to be moisturized. Now this product line is the product line that they had at the PX and the shampoo wasn't all that bad, so I was just like, hey, it was only $5.99. I ordered it from Amazon. I'm gonna see if it works. It's a hair smooth and repair vanilla bean hair butter for frizzy, unruly hair. Defrizz, men restore. So I'm gonna just try it out. I'm gonna bring some of it with me and see how it works. So that is it. I think that's it. Yeah, some more stuff coming in from Amazon, but like I said, I don't wanna like, I ain't about to show you it all. I'm gonna clean up this area so I can get to scrapbooking and putting that all together. Um, as always, if you have a question, ask a question and I will see you guys a little later with probably more of a sit down formal video. Um, let me know what you wanna hear first. You wanna hear about reception? Like I said, I really wanna wait to give you those videos because I need to give you all the details. Yeah, so don't, so don't. I might be able to give you reception, but the days after that, like the the actually getting to basic training, you guys are gonna have to wait on those videos. Um, but let me know what you wanna hear. You want, let me know. Let me know down below what you wanna hear. Um, they had a massage appointment come through for my area today, and it was gonna be for tomorrow. I almost took it, but I was like, Tanzania, you're doing too much. You really do it too much. Don't do too much, okay? Don't do too much while you're here, chill out. All right, so like I said, as always, if you have a question, ask a question, and I will see you guys later.